Good morning, children. How are you all? Hope you all are fine. So, children, this week in English, what did you do? You did all the grammar till now. You have learned what is noun and what is common noun, proper noun. I hope you understood it very well. Where where you have what is uh, where common noun and what is proper noun and what is noun and one more grammar thing you did where to use the full stop and commas. I hope everything is clear in grammar. Now the last part, uh, two more things are left in your uh, uh, this lesson that is question and answers and one letter. Today let us do the question and answers and tomorrow I will teach you how to write a letter. Okay, so children in uh, these question answers all will take out page number 54 first of your semester books. Please take out page 54. True friends, your lesson is there. Take out page number 54. We will do the question answers of this lesson. Okay. Um, lesson everybody is clear. It is about the true friends. Sudama so and Krishna, how they used to stay. It is about their childhood. They were friends. They went to Guru's ashram. They studied there and they there they learned many things and they became very true friends and good friends. Then they came back. Then about their life, all those things was there. So uh, you have understood the whole lesson. Let us read the question answers and let us see whether you are able to answer the question answers or not. So did you all take out children? Take out page number 54. Page 54, let us do the question and answer. So in page number 54, the first question is, uh, where did Krishna and Sudama go to study? I hope you all know where did Krishna and Sudama go to study. Tell me, where did they go to study? You might have read the lesson na, and, my, and you have understood the lesson also. So, where did Krishna and Sudama go to study? Yes, they went to Guru's ashram. Guru's ashram to study. In new words also, I told you the meaning of Guru's ashram. And you know that the house of Guru is known as Guru's ashram. So, where did Krishna and Sudama go? They went to Guru's ashram to Krishna and Sudama went to study at the Guru. So first answer all will see Krishna, Krishna and Sudama and Sudama went to Guru's ashram, Guru's ashram to study. So this is your first answer. This is your first answer. Krishna and Sudama went to Guru's ashram. Where did they go? You have to learn this word. Whole answer you will get from the question itself. Guru's ashram to study. Krishna and Sudama went to Guru's ashram to study. So which word you have to learn for the first answer? Guru's ashram. If you learn this word, your full first answer, you will be perfect. Okay. So all of you got it now. Krishna and Sudama went to Guru's ashram to study. Very good. Next question. Now let us come to you. question number two. First answer, I think everybody is perfect. Let us come to question number two. What is question number two? When Sudama went to visit Krishna, what did he take for him? Sudama went to meet Krishna na, uh, when they became big and after many years, uh, what happened? One day, Sudama went to Krishna. So, uh, what did Sudama, Sudama took something na, to Krishna? I hope you remember. He, he thought, why I should not go to my friend empty handed? How can I go after so many years like this? But he did not have anything much to take. So what did he take to me when he went to Krishna to meet? What did he 
take? What did Sudama take along with him for Krishna? One thing you remember. What did he take? Gifts? Many gifts or many things? No. He did not have many things to take. He took poha. I told you the meaning of poha also. What was the meaning of poha? Flattened rice. Flattened rice. And everybody knows what is poha. You all have. So that poha only he took for Krishna as a gift. He took the, for Krishna. So what did he take? Sudama took poha for Krishna. What will be the second answer? Sudama took poha for Krishna. Only one word you have to learn and other thing. Sudama took poha. If you learn this word poha, you will learn the full answer. Sudama took poha for whom? For Krishna. When he went to meet Krishna, what did he take? Poha. What did he take? Poha. Sudama took Poha for Krishna. What did he take? Poha. If you learn the first answer, what did you learn? Gurush Ashram. Then you have learned the first answer. Second answer, what did he take? The main word you have to learn is Poha. The main word you have to learn is Poha. He took Poha for Krishna as a gift. As a gift. Because he was going to meet him after many years, he took poha as a gift. Okay. Now, let's come to third question. Let's come to third question. What is third question? When Sudama went to visit Krishna, how did Krishna feel? Feel? What is the meaning of feel? Feel matla? Kesa laga? Kesa laga? When Sudama went to Krishna, Sudama jab Krishna se milne gaya. That time, how did Krishna feel? Krishna ko kesa laga? Krishna ko kesa laga? How did he feel? When your friends come and meet you, how do you feel? Suddenly after many times, now see lockdown is going on and you, you are not able to meet your friends. Think suddenly one day if your friend comes and meets you, how will you feel? If your best friend comes one day and suddenly in this lockdown, if, you're, if you meet your friend, what will be your feeling? Your feeling, you will feel very, very happy by meeting your friend. So, when Sudama went to Krishna, how might have Krishna felt? Krishna might have felt very happy. Yes, he felt very happy because his best friend, his true friend came to meet him. So, how did Krishna feel? Krishna felt very happy. How did he feel? Krishna felt very happy. So, what will be the third answer? Very small answers I am giving you. If you learn children, you will be able to learn it very fast. But don't keep it aside. When you write, you write neatly and then you learn. Okay, got it. So, third answer, your third answer will be Krishna. How did he feel? Krishna felt very happy. Krishna felt very happy. Krishna felt very happy. See, I made a happy face. How did Krishna feel? Krishna felt very happy. Happy means very joy. Bahut khush hona. Understood na? So, how did he feel? He felt very, very happy. Because he met his friend. His best friend came to meet him. He felt very happy. Okay. Now we will go to the last question, fourth question. What is the fourth question? Read children, I, when I am reading, na, please keep your fingers on where I am reading. So that you can, you will be able to read it. Okay. So now all of you keep your fingers on fourth question. I hope you took out the page when I said. 
Now keep your fingers on fourth question. I am reading the fourth question. How did Krishna know that Sudama needed help? How did did Sudama go and tell Krishna that I need your help? I am very poor. I don't have anything to eat, and my uh, every like I am very poor. Did Sudama go for this reason to Krishna to tell all this? No, he did not. He went. He gave poha, and he met his friend. He did not tell anything about him. He did not tell all his difficulties to Krishna. He did not tell. Then how did Krishna come to know? Krishna knew, na? With uh, Krishna knew that his friend by his face and by his actions and all, Krishna understood that his friend Sudama. Has some problem and with his supernatural power, I told you the meaning of supernatural also. What was the meaning of supernatural? Supernatural was magical. Krishna had supernatural power, magical power. With that power, he was able to find out that he was about Sudama and. With that power itself, what did he do? He made his small house into a big palace. And when Sudama went back, what happened? He saw his wife and his children wearing all new new clothes, and his small house became a big palace. He understood that his friend has helped him. That is. friend has helped him so the answer is with his supernatural natural power supernatural is magical supernatural is magical so fourth answer i will write fourth answer is with his super natural with his supernatural power Krishna knew that Sudama needed help. So understood with his supernatural power. This is the main answer. With his supernatural power, Krishna knew that Sudama needed help. That Krishna knew that Sudama needed help. Sudama did not tell Krishna, but with his super Krishna with his supernatural power, the main answer is supernatural power. Supernatural power. Krishna knew that Sudama needed. Hell. So I hope you understood all these four answer. Let me go uh, give a quick uh, revision of all these four question answers again, and hope you will write this neatly in your copy. Where did Krishna and Sudama go to study? Krishna and Sudama went to Guru's ashram to study. The second, when Sudama went to visit Krishna, what did he take for him? What did he take for him? Sudama took poha for him. When Sudama went to visit Krishna, how did Krishna feel? Krishna felt very happy. Krishna felt very happy. How did Krishna know that Sudama needed help? With his supernatural power, Krishna knew that Sudama needed help. So, children, we have completed all these four question answers. i will send you in your group write these question read and write it very very neatly in your copy we will continue with the letter tomorrow till then take care be happy stay safe stay safe goodbye love you all